out. And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to activate mods in DBZ Dragon Ball Z 10 Karate Tag Team. So today we're going to have to enter this one. So as you guys can see on my screen right there, um, there are two Dragon Ball Z 10 Karate Tag Teams, alright? So this one is the original one. If you can look there, it says storage slash you know those numbers slash download slash Dragon Ball Z Ten Karate Tag Team PSP ISO. That that is the real game. Then over here we've got the mod DBZ Tag Team Universe Complete Edition Three. Now if you go into one of them, they are gonna look exactly the same. They are literally exactly the same. All right, I'll show you. I'll show you all. They are literally exactly the same, all right? Look at that. See that? So, I'm going to show you guys how to activate the mods. So, this can work on any version, the real one, the modern one. But you must download a mod. And I'll put the link to the YouTuber I downloaded the mod in. I give him all the credit. So, I'll put the link down below if, if I can. And if I can, I will just... Um, give his name and you guys search it up and you guys download the mod for yourselves. So this is the Xenoverse one mod. Yeah, it's the Xenoverse mod. So I'm gonna use the normal one just to show you guys it can work, alright? So we're just gonna long press on that. See? Then you wanna go to game settings. See? Okay, you've got all the settings. Frame sleeping 3, full screen, you know, all that. And then you wanna go to tools. Then you wanna go to developer tools. Now, if these two are not ticked, you gotta tick them. But that's only after you do the instructions that the YouTuber told me. You after you do those instructions, you head on back to your PSP, your PSP. PP. Then, guys, you saw we have ticked those two blocks. Go back, go back, and go back. Now you just wanna wait a few seconds. That's right. Seconds over. All right. Now we're gonna hop into this one. Now you guys have seen the mod, and look at that. It changed. I'm just gonna skip all this. See? It still has the ten character tag team voices and all that stuff. So we're just gonna start this. Yeah, you know, ordinary. But then, but then there's gonna be this thing where it works. Oh my gosh, it's laggy. And there, look at that. It shows the ordinary picture on the uh, on the left. Uh, I mean, on the right side, it shows the ordinary picture. But on the left side, it shows the Xenoverse modern versions. For that, you're gonna hit on the back here. And you wanna press on the first one. The first one I'm on right now. And then under that, uh, and then on that you'll see save state and load state. You wanna click load state. Alright. And then like a bit, free battle. Now you can tap on the free battle. And press X, confirm. And look at that. Oh my gosh, it's lagging. Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, Gohan, Gohan Adol, King Gohan, Goku Vegeta, Vegeta of the Skata, um, Goku Ultra Instinct, Trunks Future, I don't know why that's what Trunks Future, then it's Bardock, but okay. Go Tanks, Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, you know, Turley's, all those people. Oh my gosh, it's gonna lag. And for some reason, Topo, it doesn't load him in. It shows much and pool. And that I do not ha know how to fix. That you're going to have to go and complain to the creator of the game. But I just wanted to show you guys how to load this mod in case you wanted to, to load in the mod. Uh, I have to show you how to load in the mod. So, so if you feel like loading it in, go ahead. Nothing will be done to you. Oh my gosh. So yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, tell me what you guys want next from me.